let's now look at the qualifier clause what the qualifier clause can be used with is a window function so it can be used to uh, filter results that are an output of a window function and if you are not familiar with what window function is uh, please check out the video after this video that will be coming up soon uh, let's look at the query for qualifying clause let's say we have a table which looks like this uh, we have a uh, web product kale and quarters q1 q2 q3 q4 and the category for the product vegetable and the purchases this uh, integer value and if we plot uh, if we look at the table uh, as such in here as an output we see that these are the vegetables and there are three vegetables and there are two fruits in here so what we can do is we can write a window function over this column category and then see how we can use the qualifier clause so the idea is to rank each of these products based on i think the purchases and then we can use that you we can use a qualify filter here to filter out the results such that keep only we keep only those results that have a rank that is less than or equal to three or uh, right so we just have one and two here so if we look at the query now uh, this is the table produce and from the table produce what we have is and this particular select statement with q1 product and this is the window function what we are trying to do is we are partitioning over the category column and ordering by purchases so we partition over this category column which has fruit and vegetable categories and we order it based on the purchase column and then we rank it so what we mean by that is we rank it to get us the rank for each of the products that we have and so before we use the qualify rank let's look at the output we get if we simply use this uh, method where let's also remove the filter where product category is vegetable let's keep everything in there and run this so okay didn't select the w there okay now this should work so we have the uh, in the output now we have the q1 column we have the product column and we have the rank for each of these products by the category so it might help here if we could use the category column as well maybe sad category category and run this again so if we run this let's see what we get okay so here's what we have we have uh, what we did with the uh, window function is we partition by category so what we are saying is take the category by its, uh, take each type of category and rank it order it first by the uh, purchase number uh, value in the purchases and then rank it so here we have rank one and two so orange is first apple is two and that's because here we have the fruit orange which has 37 and rank fruit apple which is 12 so this is a higher number so this is ranked one and this is ranked as two i think that's how this is yep so the apple is ranked two in this case and similarly the vegetables are ranked so vegetables we have 45 is the highest that's all spinach and kale is the no, sorry the yeah there's the second kale that's the lowest and uh, so in the here we have the ranks as uh, spinach is the first one and then there are two kales which are two and three so the kale one has the q1 value of 88 and that's the last one with the rank of three so what we are now doing is we are introducing a filter uh, here with a where clause after from and what that filter al filter allows us to do is 
uh, keep only the category vegetable and then we are going to add another filter that is based on the uh, this window function that we have and that window function uh, on that we are going to filter on rank so we are saying that whatever if the rank is less than or equal to 2 in vegetables only keep those records so eventually after this query is run we should not be able to see this record because of the qualifier clause as well as uh, we should not be able to see these records and that's because of this uh, where filter that we have in place so the output that we we would have after we run this query would have only should have only these two columns or uh, sorry those two records so let's run this now with with all the filters in place and here we see that we exactly have those two records in the output now let's look at another variation and for that i'm going to comment uh, comment this part and uncomment the this these lines of code so let's do that now here uh, the difference is that previously we wrote the uh, window function inside of the select clause now what we are doing here is we are writing the window function right at the qualify clause as you can see so this part we have written right at the qualify uh, clause and it would still work in the same way as it did before so if we run this query now we should get the same output with two categories and we do have two categories and the reason why we are just seeing the product is because we have not put the other column names here in the select class so let's put those in there and we should say exactly the same output now there's an extra comma there or it still is okay and this is what we have uh, except that in this case we do not have the rank column i think that we had earlier which was this one which was as rank but the output nevertheless is the same if we change this to less than or equal to two because earlier we had that as a filter so we have those same output we have the spinach and kale and those are the two vegetables so that was it for the qualify clause if you have any comments or suggestions please do let me know in the comments section below i really appreciate your support if you would like to see any special uh, sql statements to be brought up and discussed in the videos please do let me know that as well i hope to see you all in the next video until then please like share and subscribe thank you